here we're trying to find a value of c where the matrix A is non-invertible. For a matrix to be non-invertible, that means that when you try to row reduce, you are going to get a row of 0, 0. So something like that. This is an indication that it's non-invertible. So if I multiply row 2 by 1 half here, we're going to have 2, 1, and then here we have 2, and then c over 2. If c over 2, and it doesn't really matter what's here, because we just, we're just trying to get this row to be 0, 0. Now if I take row, row 2 times mi minus row 1, then this will be a zero, and if we set this, if we set c over two equals one, then this number will also be zero. So we have that z equals two. Alternatively, it, when it's a two by two, you can think of that this is a, b, c, and d, and we when we do the inverse trick, we have one over a d minus b c times some some stuff here. If a d minus b c turn out to be zero, then we can divide by zero, and that's also an indication that a matrix is not invertible. So a d is two times c, and b c is four. So if if two c minus four then A is non-invertible. And we now solve for C. We add 4 to the other side. And divide by 2. So C equals 2. Get the same result. And this is the answer to the problem.